I've got 50 crazy, insane, random facts that I have especially curated for you, for your ASMR enjoyment. How did I get these plethora, the cornucopia of these random facts? Well, I went clickety-clack on a keyboard in ChatGPT and said, hey, make me a list of 50 random facts for an ASMR video. Sure, here's a list of 50 random facts that would be perfect for an ASMR video. These facts cover a variety of topics, from science and nature to history and trivia, making them engaging and relaxing for your audience. Job done, right? Fact number one, which is really not that random. Honey never spoils. Who doesn't know that? That's such a normal, God, that's like the most normy random fact I've ever encountered. Everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. Honey never spoils. Archaeologists have found pots of honey in ancient Egyptian tombs that are over 3,000 years old and still edible. Now, the actual random fact that is not on here, but I know, is that honey can spoil. It depends on the water content. Some bees, some honeybees, specifically ones in, uh, I believe it's Brazil, like South American countries, they have a higher water content in their honey. Their honey ferments almost immediately. It will spoil. Honey made from the European honeybee does not because it will crystallize. The water escapes, it crystallizes, it solidifies, and that is what keeps it from spoiling. Actual random fact. Number two, bananas are berries. Okay, botanically speaking, bananas qualify as berries, but Strawberries do not. Really? Strawberries are not berries, but bananas are. Bananas are berries, okay. But strawberries are not berries? That's crazy. That's, that's a deep dive. That's a deep dive. What is a berry? What botanically qualifies as a berry? What is the definition? Okay. Okay. Cats. Number three. Cats have five toes on their front paws, but only four on their back paws. Okay. Yeah, I knew that. I knew that. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I don't know if that's 100% always true. I feel like there is, there are some cats that the female has five claws on their back paws, like the dew claw. I could be wrong, and I might be thinking of some other stuff, but I know that's a thing. So, but yeah, toe, maybe they're not, maybe they're not technically a toe, it's just a claw. is called a flamboyance. I feel like I knew that. I feel like I'd, I'd heard that before. Groups of birds are always fun, you know, like there's a parliament of ravens, there's a murder of crows, there's a, an exuberance of, is it starlings or doves? No, it's a, it's a murmuration of starlings. And then uh, an exuberance of, I think it's doves. I think it's doves or uh, something. Yeah, very fun. Also an interesting subject to go into. Number five, butterflies taste with their feet. They have, they actually have taste sensors on their feet to help them find food. I I mean, to be honest, that makes sense. You know? Because otherwise you'd have to take a...
bite out of everything. Like they don't have tongues. They can't lick. You know, they can't lick a, a thing before they eat it. So it makes sense to have it on their feet. Okay. That's interesting. Number six. The shortest war in history lasted just 38 to 45 minutes. It was fought between the British Empire and the Sultanate of Zanzibar in 1896. The British Empire be wild and indeed they had some uh, yeah they had some crazies in there they had some good stuff Octopuses have seven hearts. This is fact number seven. Octopuses have three hearts. Two pump blood to the gills, while one pumps it to the rest of the body. Interesting. I wonder if it, it could be that each heart is tied to like one gill. So like one gill right here. You got the left heart right pumped there. Because if you lost one of the gills, you basically just have an organ that's not doing anything. So they've got to be they've got to be sympathetic and they're all connected. I would imagine that's the case. Number eight. Sharks have been around longer than trees. Crazy. But kind of makes sense because you figure life evolving on the ocean, you know, existing in the ocean would have existed way before, you know, other things, probably even before any, you know, what botanical life on, you know, land did, probably all started in the ocean, then moved on there, and then obviously trees are a very distinct, you know, genotype of plant. Yeah, that's not necessarily going to happen. Yeah, like, I mean, you figure trees are probably not going to be able to be supported, you know, by, like, the ground, the earth, root systems, and these types of things growing very tall until there's a fairly established, you know, soil base, which is going to come about by, you know, having lots of shrubs growing, dying, decaying, making that soil base. It's interesting, but not that crazy. <laughs> Number nine, a day on Venus is longer than a year on Venus. Oh, it takes Venus about 243 days, Earth days, to rotate once, but only about 225 Earth days to complete one orbit around the sun. Now, that's actually not that crazy when you think about planets rotating on an axis or at all is actually a weird thing like we obviously it's normal for us but the current thinking is that that was started that was started by you know a giant impact that you know with something around the size of like mars and then you know it basically split off and you know that's why we have a moon that's, you know, huge and of a very similar composition to Earth. Yeah, that's interesting. So the fact that, you know, Venus spins at all. I mean, I, I wonder if any planet in our solar system is tidally locked. I actually don't know if that's the case. I think they all rotate. That's interesting. Number 10. Peanuts are not nuts. Did know that. They are legumes, like beans and lentils. Accurate. Yes. True. Accurate. Yeah. I did know that. Number 11. Koalas have fingerprints almost identical to human fingerprints. Even under a microscope, it's hard to distinguish between the two. Interesting. I mean, I gotta be honest, yeah, how many, how many animals have fingerprints? Huh? Number 12, hot water, freezing.
freezes faster than cold water. Ah, this is known as the Mapemba effect. Now, I actually did kind of weirdly know this from like a science demonstration that I saw in a, in a museum one time, and I came up with a bullshit answer. Like, my mom asked me why that happened, and I came up with like a totally just off the cuff I had no basis in this whatsoever but it sounded convincing to her she goes oh yeah that makes sense I still don't know if, if that's true but freezes faster than cold water interesting number 13 the Eiffel Tower can be 15 centimeters taller during the summer because of thermal expansion the metal expands in the heat yeah okay I wonder now, I would imagine that is because it's an open air, you know, it's just bare metal. And, you know, it doesn't have to support anything else. It doesn't have to have, like, you know, there's no windows. There's none of this other stuff that's, like, constricting the growth. I wonder if any skyscraper around the size of the Eiffel Tower would grow and shrink to a similar amount. Or if they've kind of built in to the, you know, architectural specifications that it, it can't, you know, shift that much. I wonder. Number 14, the longest word in the English language is 189,819 letters long. It's the chemical name for the protein T-I-T-I and Titan. Though it's not commonly used in everyday language. Yeah, it, it, that doesn't count. Get out of here. That doesn't actually count. The longest word in the English language that's actually a word is, unless it's changed, anti-disestablishmentarianism. Number 15, you can't hum while holding your nose. Try and see. Pfft, easy, easy. I'm pretty sure that was a hum. I'm pretty sure that was a hum. I'm pretty sure that counts as humming. Loser. A jiffy is an actual unit of time. It is one one the hundredth of a second. Yes. If. Yes, that's actually true. It's hilarious. Depending on how much of a lunatic your high school physics teacher was, you might have known this. You may have known that. Number 17, the unicorn is Scotland's national animal. ChatGPT is lying to me. That's definitely not true. It has been a symbol of Scotland since the 12th century. That's the, that's the lie. That's a lie. No way. I don't believe that at all. If you're from Scotland, let me know. Dido. Yeah, all right, it's up to you. You have to confirm this. I'm I'm pretty sure ChatGPT is lying to me. Yeah, I think so. Number 18. There are more stars in the universe than grains of sand on all the Earth's beaches. Yes, that's... I mean, it's a very interesting, like, you know, a hugely wildly expansive thing. But, yeah. The universe is big. Number 19. Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system. Yeah. Even though Mercury is closer to the sun, Venus has a thick atmosphere that traps heat. Yes. I did know that. That was another one that I knew. That's what, three? Psh, I'm acing this. Yeah, but it is interesting. Although, let's be honest, Mercury and Venus are very close to the sun. They're both very, very, very close. Yeah, there's not there's not a huge difference in their distance. They're they're quite close. Number twenty. A blue whale's heart is as large as a small car. How small is a small car? Number twenty one. Wombat poop is cubed shape. Is cube shaped. This helps it stay.
stay in place and mark their territory. Okay. I can understand when you find wombat poop, it's cube shaped. They grab it, they, you know, turn it into a cube so that they can stack it and, you know, play blocks with it. I get that. It's not coming out of the wombat as a cube, okay? They do not have a square-shaped Play-Doh extruder for an anus. That is not true. That is misleading, if it's true. A group of owls is called a parliament. Interesting, we, we, we touched on this before. So there's, I think there are actually a couple of things that are called a parliament. I think, yeah, I'm almost positive ravens are a parliament. Is it a parliament? Oh, okay, I have to look that up. Let's think. Um, group of ravens. In unkindness. Oh, and a conspiracy. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. In unkindness. That was the, that was the more interesting one. Okay. Group of owls is called a parliament. Why was I thinking? Oh, you know what? I know I was thinking of. It was called a parliament. It's from a uh, book I was reading, which I guess got it wrong. Number 23, the longest recorded flight of a chicken is 13 seconds. Interesting. Number 24, the shortest commercial flight in the world is just 1.7 miles long. It connects two Scottish islands and takes less than two minutes. Okay, yeah, I suppose that makes sense. Yeah. Number 25, a snail can sleep for three years. I guess, although then you're running into definitional issues like what's sleep? What? How do you define sleep and not like a coma? You know, like total, you know, stasis of all bodily functions. Yeah, is that sleep? I don't know. Number 26. There are more than 10,000 different types of tomatoes. It's a lot of types of tomatoes. 10,000 different types of tomatoes. Well, okay, you know what? Yeah, I mean, you got your grape tomatoes, you got your cherry tomatoes, you got your... Roma tomatoes, you got your beefsteak tomatoes, you got your like Campari tomatoes. I would imagine you've got, you know, different varietal tomatoes. I wonder if they classify different like uh, growth periods. Like, so like you got green tomatoes, you got, you know, red tomatoes, yellow tomatoes, you know, heirloom tomatoes, you know, all kinds. Yeah. Okay. I could see that. I could see that. Yeah. Okay. Number 27, elephants are the only animals that can't jump. Their large size and weight make jumping physically impossible. Elephants can jump. They'll just be, like, destroyed if they jump. Okay, if an elephant needed to jump, it's going to be able to, to jump. Okay, it's going to die if it jumps. But that doesn't mean it's impossible that it can't jump. It just means that the consequences for jumping are wildly radical. Come on, get out of here. Number 28. The average person will spend about six months of their life waiting for red lights to turn green. sobering thought. Run red lights if 
you're ever in a car and there is a red light, just go through it. You got six months to save. Are you kidding me? Don't actually do that. I don't. I don't. Uh, I don't condone you doing that. Number twenty-nine. Your nose and ears continue to grow throughout your life. This is kind of true, but also not really as not really true the way that they want you to think it's true. It's kind of true. It's not. It's like like your nose can grow, but it's not like your nose continues growing at the same rate. It's just like the, the growth factor for it as opposed to like all these other factors of your body are not 100% shut down. It's, yeah. Number 30. A group of jellyfish. A lot of group facts here. A group of jellyfish is called a smack. Smack. Number 31. There are more than 2,000 different species of cacti. Let down. Absolute let down. Come on. 10,000 types of tomato, but only 2,000 types of cacti. Loser. Number 32. A giraffe's tongue is about 18 inches long. They got a long tongue. Yeah, that's true. Number 33. Ostriches have the largest eyes of any land animal. Also the largest eggs, but you knew that. Their eyes are around two inches in diameter. The largest eyes of any land animal. What animals are bigger than ostrich? Okay. So ostriches have larger eyes than like an elephant. Okay. I mean, I guess elephants don't really need really great eyes or anything, but okay. Huh. Number 34. The heart of a shrimp is located in its head. Now we're running it. Where? What's a head? Is the head everything above the tail? Then, yeah, obviously. But if the head is like, oh yeah, it's like, you know, it's it's where, it's, it's like, you know, where its brain would be. Come on. I guess, yeah. It's like, or is it like below, like, hey, it's in its torso. Its torso is just like, you know, that big. Yeah. Number 35. Most of the dust in your home is made up of dead skin cells. We all knew this. It's a horrific, disgusting fact, but yes. Accurate and well-known. Number 36. A day on Mars is just over 24 hours long. It's about 24.6 hours. Now that's crazy. That's, I mean, it's not crazy that it's 24 hours long. It's just the odds that a day on Mars is almost identical to a day on Earth. That's, the odds of that are, are bananas. Number 37. The moon has moonquakes. Just like earthquakes on Earth, these are seismic activities on the moon's surface. That's interesting. I do wonder if they're caused by the same thing, because I don't think the moon has like tectonic plates. I, I don't think it does. I could be wrong, and I mean, maybe we don't necessarily 100% know, uh, you know, if they're, you know, like, does it just have like a mantle? Is there a, you know, a, a liquid core to the moon? Is there a, you know, is, is that what's happening? Because I, uh, we know there's not a magnetosphere around the moon, which, you know, is caused by the fact that we've got, you know, an inner core, and then we've got a mantle, and it's spinning. You know, that's what's creating, you know, the magnetosphere around Earth, as we were taught in the core with Aaron 
backyard. So I wonder if the moon quakes are like caused by the same things. I don't know. Also an interesting rabbit hole to go down. Number 38. More people are allergic to cow's milk than any other food. Okay. Allergic. Allergic. If you're not capable of digesting lactose because you lack a certain protein, is that technically an allergy? I might argue all allergies could be like defined as like histamines. You know, like if you have like if you like a histaminergic response. So if you take antihistamines, your allergy goes away. I don't know if anyone is like actually allergic by that definition as, as most people conceive of allergies to cow's milk. I don't know. Number 39. Kangaroos can't walk. Muscular legs and large tails prevent them from moving in reverse. I mean, like, this is the same thing with, like, elephants can't jump. They can jump. They just don't, because it would be catastrophic. Kangaroos can't walk backwards, and I'm like, you mean they can't, like, <laughs> like, if they're leaning over... They've got a tail. They can't. They can't scoot back a little bit. They can scoot back a little bit. They can't moonwalk. Okay, sure. But can't walk backwards at all. Nah, nah. I don't buy it. I don't buy it. Number forty, which is actually the same as another one. ChatGPT failing us all again. AI is not taking over anybody's jobs anytime soon. The Eiffel Tower grows in the summer. The heat makes the metal expand. Where have we heard that before? Number 41. We're, we're getting into the dregs of facts here. A single strand of spider silk is stronger than steel of the same thickness. Yeah. Yeah, I, 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 I know. I think everybody knows that. That's like one of the most, again, crazy normie. Everybody knows that fact. Okay. Like, if you were alive when the original Sam Raimi Spider-Man movies came out, you know that fact. You know that fact. In fact, if you've watched probably any Spider-Man movie, they have directly stated that. Spider-Silk has a higher tensile strength than steel. Number 42. Most people can't lick their elbows it's physically impossible for most humans. Okay, we have to try it. <laughs> no, okay. Try it. Try it. Tell me. Tell me if you can. Number 43. The longest living animal is the Greenland shark. It can live up to 400 years. Number 
86. We don't know this, actually. Dolphins have names for each other. They use unique whistles to identify and communicate with each other. Names. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Number 47. as much as an elephant. Blue whales are big boys. Number 48. Horses have been domesticated for over 5,000 years. That's cool. Do you know how long cats have been domesticated for? Somewhere between eight and 9,000 years. Do you know how long dogs have been domesticated for? I believe the estimate is something around like, like 12 to 15,000 years. Which is why dogs are much more domesticated than these other things. Plus, you know, dogs, wolves, and these types of things. You know, I just have a a better brain in terms of, like, connecting with humans. Which might be because of domestication, but might not be. Might, might be unrelated. Might just be a happy coincidence. Number 49. A person's sense of smell is strongest in the mind morning. Interesting. So we actually probably have morning breath all the time. We just only notice it in the morning because our sense of smell is so acute. Okay. Number 50. The Great Wall of China is not visible from space with the naked eye. Contrary to popular belief, it's quite challenging to see from space without aid. That makes perfect sense to me. The things like this, like double this wide, okay? You're gonna be able to see the length of it. It's this wide. It's a piece of string a hundred miles away. There's like, it's so unlikely. Yeah, you're gonna be able to like, you know, again, with your naked eye, just be able to look down and see a river. Yeah, like, Unless it's a huge, giant, you know, mile-long river, it's going to be rough to see. Even if, even if the thing is, you know, as long as, like, the Mississippi. Anyway, those were 50 crazy, weird, random facts. I hope you enjoyed. What was your favorite fact? Good luck in all your endeavors. Thank you for tuning in. Sorry about the lawn mowing that happened, but... Eh, it happens. And I shall say goodbye for now.